Here's a quick video on tabs and uh, how to deal with them in SQL Management Studio. And here I've got some sample code that uh, I think is reasonably formatted, at least to my standards. So um, what I'd like to do is maybe take this, this code here and copy and paste it over into something else like a blog entry or um, let's say Notepad for instance. So here we go, and I paste it in there, and notice that um, some of the, the things that I liked about um, my formatting here, let's see if I can line them up next to each other, uh, have gone away. So for instance, I line these up here, the employee ID here, the null is directly underneath it, but in uh, Notepad, now the null is uh, pushed over here to the right. Same thing with employees.reports2 here and then it's pushed way to the right so I've lost a lot of the formatting that I liked so um, what's going on uh, and how do I deal with it well the first thing is that there is an option under advanced you to view the white space if I click on that what I can see is uh, that I've got uh, dots that are space characters and I've got arrows which are tab characters and the problem is that tabs are um, are not consistent across editors. So that if I take uh, a tab in SQL Management Studio, right now it's equal to exactly three spaces. But if I were to copy this and paste it into Microsoft Word, a tab might mean half an inch or an inch. And I can even adjust uh, what a tab is worth in most editors. So as I move my code from editor to editor, uh, alignment gets messed up because tabs don't always mean the same thing. So what I, I'd like to do or prefer to do with source code like this is to not use tab characters. I'd like to use all space characters rather than tabs. So one of the options that I can do is if I highlight everything uh, under edit advanced I have options to tabify and untabify my selections so I'm going to untabify and what I see is that they've all become uh, space characters rather than tabs and now if I copy all of this over into notepad what I'll find is what I'll find is that my alignment is still good and my code is still formatted nicely uh, because spaces are much more consistent and robust to copying across editors. Now, that tabify and untabify, unfortunately, does not always work. And the tabifying really is only for the left aligned portions. Uh, so, so tabs, uh, you may not get rid of all the tabs by untabifying. So here's another thing that you might want to do is if I go to options for the editor so I'm going to close up this and go to the options for the text editor and then all languages and expand that and look at tabs what I might want to do is set a tab size so for instance um, one of a tab character is now going to be equivalent to three characters or three spaces and I'm going to say insert spaces rather than tabs here. So I'll say OK now. And notice what will happen when I hit the tab key. I don't get, oops, sorry, I don't get tab characters. I get space characters. And as a matter of fact, I get exactly three characters. So if you set this option in your editor, uh, you'll never generate tabs and when you do generate tabs or when you do use the tab key you can set it to the number of spaces that you like so I prefer three you might like four you might like two you might like eight uh, but that's how you use tabs in SQL